So this is a little short video just to show how to upload the data file from a Holter test to Alba Medical for analysis. So this is a little data card that we took out of the Holter monitor and we use this uh, data card reader which has um, got a, a, a USB plug and it shows you on the side how the orientation to insert the card so we put the card into the card reader and then we just plug this into a USB port of the computer I'll plug it in a USB right there okay now on your computer screen there should be a right here it is see it says no name that's just uh that's just a little card reader we just said and if you open that you'll see it's got a the data file <clears throat> that's the data that uh, is on the card that we just did now then I use a I have a, a, a link set up it's a Hightail uplink and the address of it is spaces can you go up there and see that right there spaces.hightail.com okay and this is for it uh, this is for uh, sending your files so it says drag files anywhere or add from my computer. So I'm going to take the file and just drag it from the, uh, okay. And then it opens up a little window. Type. I didn't get that very well. That's all right. You just drag the file on that middle. Then you're going to type in your info if I put my name. And then my email address. That's the address they're going to send your results to. And then you should type uh, any message you want here, but I always put canine holter transmission. And then I put the info about the dog, Babesian, Ridgeback, female, Galley. 20 months old and then I'm going to put her medication she's been on 30 milligrams sotalol BID and then I'm going to put my phone number 925-997-9542 and you can put any other information there that you wanted to but this is enough for them to send you the report. Oh yeah, one more thing. Um, I have my visa card registered with Alba, and so I put visa on file. Uh, before you send in a uh, data file for an, for analysis, you should go to the Alba Medical Center website and set up your charge card so they can charge you for any analyses you do, and they'll keep your card on record and you don't have to type in the card every time you send a new data file. And then you just simply upload. And now it will show you, it takes about a minute to upload the file. Well, it says 16 minutes, but it's going to be a lot faster than that. So um, it'll, it'll actually uh, be done in, in <clears throat> under two minutes, but uh, probably a minute and a half. So good, that's all you do. Then you sit back and wait and you'll get the results by email. Uh, I get them sometime, it depends I think on how many they've got in the lab, but sometimes I get the results back within a day or two. You can take a week, but uh, you'll get them back. Uh, now you see it's already, already three minutes is saying. <clears throat> and I don't know, these bars don't really, I don't understand these bars, it looks like. Uh, it started out saying 16 minutes and it's only been about two minutes and it's almost finished now. Okay, you don't need to file, uh, film the rest of it. Thank you. Thank you, Louisa.